To you, Lord, be all the praise, all the glory, all honor, all adoration. Thank you, Lord of God, for the gift of this new day. And I pray the Lord of God, as we go forth, and even your children, as we gather to pray this morning, the Lord, you will hear our cry, and your presence will go with us today. In Jesus' name. Brethren in Christ, we take a text this morning from Nehemiah chapter 6, verse 9. Nehemiah chapter 6, verse 9. It says, For they are, were all trying to make us afraid, saying, Their hands will be weakened in the work, and it will not be done. Now, therefore, O God, strengthen my hand. Now, therefore, O God, strengthen my hand hands. And that is a key part of our prayer this morning, that the Lord will strengthen our hand today. The Lord will empower us anew for the task we are set to achieve. Nehemiah chapter 6 gives the account of Nehemiah trying to rebuild the walls of Jerusalem and Sambalat and Tobias and all the other people in the Arab world discouraged him and this particular verse came to bear is what they were all trying to make us afraid saying their hands will be weakened in the work and it will not be done whether there are forces physical or spiritual trying to make you to be afraid today. You have pondered over the night and your strength seems to be sap. Can we join and pray as Nehemiah prayed? And he said, now therefore, O God, strengthen my hands. I know in this kind of turbulent economy we are in, beloved, we need to pray that the Lord will strengthen our hands. Let us pray. Our God and our Father, we know that, Lord, in times like this, Lord, that all we need to do and all that we have is to come to you and bring a common supplication. Lord, oh God, this morning, let the heavens open over us, your children, as we go forth. What we ask, oh God, is your presence and the power of your spirit. Let it go with us today in the name of Jesus. Every tax that we are about to make an end way. And Lord, oh God, there are distractions. There are those who want us to backslide. There are those who want us to be afraid. They want us, our hands to be weakening. Today, oh God, let your divine intervention step into that project in the name of Jesus. I pray, oh God, for myself and for your children. The Lord, you will strengthen our hands. The Lord, you will empower us that that work that we start, our hand will surely complete. The Lord, oh God, doing your work halfway, abandoned project will never be a portion. But Lord, oh God, your manifestation, your power to complete, your power to finish, you will grant to us this day as we go forth in the name of Jesus. We pray the Lord, you will pour your blessings upon our work. The Lord, our labors, oh God, you will add flavor to it, oh God. The Lord, oh God, we will get to our desired point. We will get to our finished line. We will get to our point of completion. Thank you, Lord, O oh God, Heavenly Father, that we can bring forth a thanksgiving and a testimony to you. Thank you because much more you will do for every one of us to the praise and glory of your name. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Good morning, beloved, and God bless you and bless your work today. Amen.